sneeze him and uh hmm yeah you may be wondering why is this game here well reason being is I raised the sensitivity a bit uh, reason being is oh forgot to say reason being is is that someone decided to comment on a post I put on Google Plus a long time ago saying that he wants more of this. To be honest, I don't want to do this. But I have to. Plus, uh, after this video, I'm going to post uh, the previous vids of Cards Against Humanity I play with Mini, Colt, and um, Lone Wolf. So, uh, yeah. Uh, so let's just get down to business. And we already saw the intro in the first episode, so no, that's not enter. There it is. Here we are. Alrighty, let's go. Let's do this. I don't know why you people have to be so cruel, telling the only person, the only furball out there, to play a game that is nobody would bother to play due to. God dang it! Don't do that. I just started playing. I just started playing, and I almost got a heart attack. None of the lights off are none of the lights are off in my room, by the way. So don't. So uh, even though it is, I'm still gonna get scared. The immersion will get me. But yeah, someone decided to comment on like a long, long ago post, and now I'm playing this. this? Have I read this one before? Phil, if you see this, my radio is busted. Heading back to the access ladder to grab a replacement. Hank. I assume he never made it to the access ladder. Now we do know that as soon as we head to the generator um, and we grab the glow sticks, we know crap's going to go down and we also know that the generator's going to explode as soon as we leave the area. So we have to be lucky and get a hallway that doesn't lead to an immediate dead end. So I hope. Oh yeah, by the way, I got a new headset. Previous headset broke. Uh, it was on X. Anyone in there? Okay. Previous headset broke due to an accident. Dang it, I gotta stop stepping on crap. How do I, can, how, how can I tell what's glass and what's water? God dang it, don't do that! <laughs> Dear lord. Oh yeah, some of you people have been asking me in, um... What the heck, I've never seen this before. It's a conduct, it's worker's hat. And it's going through the floor. <laughs> Another note over here. Let's read. It sure smells down here. It's taking a lot of more turns to get to the generator rooms than I remembered, Hank. Well, I don't think Hank lived. I always thought there was a theory to this game. Like it was all a dream. A dead end? I just walked down this hallway. I think this is all a dream. Pipe blue behind me. Okay, <laughs> that's that's one thing to know. What the frick? Is this the same conductor's hat? I mean, worker hat. What the heck? Now there's a map, and now there's a freaking way to go. Where did this come from? Oh, another note. Let's see what it says. There's something definitely following me. I swear, if that's you, Phil, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> Just keep walking. Just keep walking. Just keep walking. I'm going to take a left. I don't like taking a left. So, I never take a left. I always take a right. Because whenever I go left, it always leads to somewhere bad. I have this on windowed mode, so it still scares me, even on windowed mode. That's how immersed this game gets you. That is a lot of water. Just avoid half of that. Oh, 
go right. Hey, hey. Don't do that. God dang it. Stop it. Hank, where are you? Are you getting my notes? I don't even know where I am. I think there's something down here with us. I'm still looking for the water pump room to help look for your keys. Got the glow sticks, but this is odd. This is the water pump room. I could fall down that hole because I literally just walked over to the edge. Running, 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 running. Oh, that's where to go. Hold up, this is the generator. Wait, I just came back from the water pump room? I could crouch here. I'm safe here for now. The keys! Well, what do you know? Fortunately, I can't see. That's a pop. Pop a glowy. Just to be safe. And go in here. Just for a little bit of recovery. Yep, alrighty. So, we're off to a good start. Better not jinx it. Alright, let's go. <laughs> get moving, you! Get moving! Stop! Get moving! Sprint! I said sprint! Don't walk! Sprint! Okay. 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 Let's keep going forward. I could have just did a smart thing and cut the corner. Uh, definitely hear something. Yeah, I have. We've read that before. Taking a right. I'm going straight ahead. doing that. Enough with the steam, please. Oh, no. Okay, I'm going this way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go this way. Screw that. I'm, go, I'm going this way. Now, the reason why it, this game scares you because of the immersion is because, A, you have to get close to this. It's in windowed mode right now for me. But I have to get really close to the screen to actually see where I'm going. Balls. Great. Is that a hole in the floor? Yes. Get me inside. Phew. Alrighty. Hole in the wall. Saved me. Alrighty. Phew. That, that gave me a slight heart attack. So, um... Maybe if this this light right here wasn't in the way, I could be able to see, because I got smudges on my screen, like a few smudges, but they're blocking off the middle of the screen, so I can't tell what's going on. I don't think setting the brightness will help either. What button's the crouch? That button. Right. I have this button on hand. Whoa! No, 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 where's that hole? Where's that hole? In the hole. In the hole. In the holy hole. Phew. Alrighty. Okay, good. Alrighty. Um. Glow stick. Anyone there? No, already. Man, boy. Dang it. You son of a gun. I'm going back to the hole. Screw that. He's over there. There's no way I'm getting past him. 
and unless somehow I manage to Metal Gear Solid freaking smack him upside the head and make him go to sleep, there's no way I'm getting past him. I don't even have any bait. I don't even think this game even has a bait mechanic. Something's changed. Oh no, it's, it's not like this. If a Markiplier ever sees this video, he's gonna have freaking war flashbacks at this game. I already read that one. I'm... Why are you always there? What is going on here? This game defies its physics so much. Back in the holy hole. You still got me! Come on! <laughs> Keyboard's loose on this table. <sighs> Retry. God dang it. Alrighty. Ready. Let's go right. When there's a will, there's a way. That's what some guy said. Not a real cock block move. What happens is if I find the door, and the map decides to change when I find the glow sticks and keys. That'll be the world's biggest cock bug right there. Don't tell me I'm going in a circle, because if I am, I'm going to be pissed. I like how my friend, uh, my friend Giovanni and my buddy Mini. Uh, Giovanni, also known as Lone Wolf. I like it how they said, oh, you should play Vanish. I recommend it to you. Yet they don't have the balls to do it themselves. Mitty says he's not doing recordings on on his computer unless it's Gary's mod. I'm like, hey, that, that doesn't make any sense. You should be multi-purpose. Dang it, stupid light. Well, anyway, you should be multi-purpose. You shouldn't be just one one thing only. Come on, it's kind of bad to be one thing only. Phil, if you see this, my radio is busted. Heading back to the action slider to grab a replacement. Alright, this is the same page. No need to read the same page over and over again, like I did in the last episode. I also hate those moments in video games. Like, it, I hate those moments in horror movies if you're, like, in that situation. Like, you're stuck down underground, and you are, there's monsters around, and one walks by, and then all of a sudden, for some odd reason, you have the nerve to, your body just has the nerve to make you sneeze or cough or whatever. Make you have, like, a, it, that's why I don't, that's why people recommend don't go to work on a sick day. <laughs> if your sciences are acting up, don't go to work. Because sooner or later, one day, this, you're going to be trapped in a cave filled with monsters. Next thing you know, you sneeze your ass off, and then you get eaten. What the frick? Oh. Wait, I have a question. Who brought me here, and who am I playing as? Since Hank and Phil are dead, I assume. Don't look back already. Looking back is for fools. I never look back. I always look forward. But one day you have to. Look back. One day you have to. Reason why. All the memories you had with your buddies. I think I saw it. Ah, because son of a... Mm, I think I just saw... Ooh, hole. I can read it in here. I think I just saw something crawl into those dirt tunnels. I wouldn't go in there if I were you. Look like a giant rat or bird. Something weird, Hank. Wait. So basically, hiding in these tunnels not only is a death wish, but there's a but there's going outside is even worse. Wait, no, going going outside, out in the blue where all these monsters are is worse, but is is bad. But going inside the tunnels is even worse because not only are you in claustrophobia, if you have it, that is, you're getting you're gonna get freaking mauled by a weird bird rat thing. Not the self. Think twice about taking an engineering job that involves the sewers. 
Son of a freaking <laughs> ready to freaking run into the freaking wall instead of just I like how this game says never look back or don't look back and yet you have to look back whenever you hit a dead end. Yeah. Oh, phew. Sorry. Just had a little bit of a shiver. It's kind of cold in my room. That didn't scare me, actually. That was odd. Sup, son? There's a note right there. I don't want it. So I'm going this way. I don't want your note. I want a life. I choose life. I want to live. Like how, as soon as the generator goes out, it's freaking dead hard to see where you're going. Well, we had a good run, first try. Got the keys and the glow sticks, like, like immediately. And then get wrecked because I tried to go into a hole and freaking this dude has the brightest idea to grab me as soon as I crawl in. Why'd I go for the neck? Anyway, it's like, is it, is, are they trained to just go for the neck? I don't exist. I don't exist. I don't exist. Don't bother. I don't exist. I don't exist. <laughs> Dang it, I broke a game rule. Don't look back. I had to. Had to make sure he wasn't following me. Because he did look over to where I was. Luckily, I managed. Follow the pipes. Don't follow the pipes. It's bad. Didn't Phil tell you something? Was it Phil? Or Hank? Not too sure. Probably with Steve. Or Jack, because I can't see it right now. Hurry, 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 hurry! Corniest joke ever made. Dang it! Aw, oh, and this is the same all I- Oh, what the heck, game? What are you doing, game? What do you want to be, game? I'm making a video. I need to have Simon in my room, because my parents and brother always barge in at the wrong time, and I don't like that, because it's weird. Who are you talking to? I'm talking to the viewers! But they view this. What the heck, he left? Okay. Feels like I'm walking in circles. That or the walls are moving on me. Where the hell is the water pump room again, Phil? Again, Phil. Wait, I have a question. Why would he lose his keys? How did he lose his keys? Did, like, the thing attached to his belt that held his keys break off or something? There's a lot of water. Meaning, I think we're getting close to the pump room. That's off in the distance. And a note. Hank, where are you? Are you getting my notes? I don't even know where I am. I think there's something... What the heck? Okay, I made it to the generator room. Got my glue sticks. I have a feeling if I go that way, it might lead to the water pump. But if I go this way, it might lead to the water pump. But the safe thing to do is to take a moment right here. Okay. Um, okay, so I can... I went... It came from there. I could go over there or there, but this way seems like a logical spot. As soon as I walk over here, run for your life! Grab this note, run! Take a lift. What? Okay. What the heck are you doing here? Get out of here. Game? Um. Game? Game? Uh... Game? Did you poop yourself? Because, uh, I'm getting a black screen here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> it took the game a second to realize I died. It was like, huh, so he's like, mm. Probably just had ADHD for a second to stand butterfly. I was like, oh, and then all of a sudden I realized it was dead. I was like, oh, you're dead. There we go. One more try, once more with feeling.
as everybody sometimes says. Crawl through the hole, take a left this time. This headset is a little bit more comfortable than the one that I used to use. My ears are a lot more comfy, and my head's a little comfy, because in fact that I just got a haircut. Plus, the mic is a little bit closer to my mouth, so it's way better than the model that I had before. Plus, the left side of the headphone doesn't go out, so I'm good. Please don't cave in. Okay. Don't cave in on me. That would be like the third death of this video. Not saying that there might be one. Just saying. Like, third death immediate. Two seconds into the third run and all of a sudden, pfft, died from cave in. They should make it an abiding Isaac 2. The binding of Isaac 2, I mean to say. The binding of Isaac, the original, was pretty good. Same thing with Rebirth. But I really wish they could make it too. Make it like an RP, like a roguelike RPG, like you get level ups too and stuff. Nah, might be too complicated. Plus, I might kill the vibe. So I'll just stick with the basics. If I was a game designer, I have some good ideas, but sometimes my ideas might get overboard, so I just keep my mouth quiet. But if you want a final boss, I can tell you one. Yeah, I already read that one. Not one or some. The heck? Why is this wide open? Never knows that door being wide open. Have I read this one before? Dang it! The ladder. Dang it, at the ladder, but forgot the keys to the access gate. And I'm on my last glow stick. There's a way I'll be able... There's no way I'll be able to find them without the extra light. And a dead end. Stay back. I have paper. I have paper, and I'm not afraid to use it. It has words on it. I will kill you with words. And it almost gave me another heart attack. You read, you die. Ready? I believe it's like 11 minutes. Not too sure. 20? And counting? Well, what do you know? Here we are. At the generator. Are we at the generator already? Jeez. Already. Headed this way and. No explosions, but there was a monster that way, so I'm not going that way. That'd be a freaking cock block move if this place exploded the second I got away from it. No, if this place exploded the second I went back because there's a monster there, that'd be a freaking cheat. Death from generator. Oh! That little speck on the screen scared the crap out of me! <laughs> it caught me off guard. There's a hole in the wall. I'm taking it. <sighs> Great branching path. Um, left. Dang it. Well, we did get the glow sticks immediately, and the power and the generator didn't blow. Dang it! I'll jinx it, so maybe, like, somewhere in the middle of this freaking generator is gonna blow. I'll go left again. That was an immediate freaking walk on. There's no way I was gonna get past that. Oh, this guy knows how to jump without making noise. He is sitting down. I'm not gonna go that way. It's a good thing that light was there. Now I know he was there.
Oh yeah, that was actually a subject I didn't finish. Basically, um, I was talking about how during horror movies, what I'd rather do, uh, or what would ha what what I hate about certain scenarios. I hate it in certain scenarios in horror movies where taking another left, where um, you're in this situation that you can't escape, and the only way is either kill your friend, sacrifice yourself, or just let it happen. And some occasions, let it happen is like the most thing to do. I mean, first of all, you're gonna die. One of you is gonna die either way, so you might as well go out together. Bros before other bros. Not hoes, because I still respect whooping. I think I took the wrong turn. Nope. Uh, I'm not reading that, because I already read it. And it So far, so good. All we need to do is find the water pump room, and we're set. Or you can get the living balls out of here if you ever find the door. There's another hole in the wall. Let's crawl on in. Still love the amnesia fact of... There's actually an, a thing in video games where if you sprint and you use the mouse... You, the only way to escape a monster without having to use the other keys during a chase, god dang it, oh, oh, texture broke, oh, nope, it fixed itself, um, is to, a little trick, if you don't want to use the other keys to, like, escape a monster while running, is to hold the shift key and the W key and use the mouse to look around, and yes, that water pump, that blue, scared the crap out of me, so don't ask. I mean, I don't get easily scared. I like playing Dead Space. I like playing horror games. Yet this game gets me with the immersion. And the fact there are notes and water puddles everywhere. Shh. I got my gun. Yeet! Did I say yeet? Sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to. I'm going this way. Screw that. Freaking. It's getting annoying in the fact that these freaking guys that keep popping out of nowhere and trying to eat my face. Can you cycle through pages? What's this one? Nah, I read that one already. Paper, paper, paper. I got paper. Not afraid to use. I'm going this way. Going is this way? You can't get me now. I'm going this way. Thank you, sir, and good night. It is 5:54. At this. Mmm, I'm sandwiched. <laughs> I don't mind being sandwiched during in the bedroom, but no, this is not the type of sandwiching I, I like. I have to say that in the bedroom. I feel weird now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everybody. If that felt weird, just say it in the comments, and I'll probably just, like, I don't know, apologize to everybody out there. Shout out to my buddy Giovanni, which is Lone Wolf. Who um, got hit twenty something views and is up to one hundred and thirty one subscribers now. So shout out to him. You get, guys can go watch him if you want to. There's a monster. I'm taking a U-turn. Screw you. I just I just freaking broke his ankles. I pulled a Cory Kenshin, and it's a dead end. Just kill me now. Nope. No, oh, you still got me. <laughs> I thought I could break his ankles again, but I didn't. Dang it. Well, guys. See you next time in another Vanish playthrough. This is part two. I thought it was going to be a one shot, but apparently it wasn't. So, yeah, part one is not really basic. I, I specifically said it was going to be a one shot, and people just berate the comments saying, Can you do more Vanish, please? And this is me. I don't want to. I just don't want to. I want to keep my man pants on and strap them. I don't want to lose them in this game because this game can get you. Like a freaking steam train on a freaking high speed chase with another speed train that's a cop train. 
if you get my drift. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next episode of Vanish or whatever uh, game I'm playing. Yes, I'm cracking my knuckles. So stay tuned for more. See you guys next time.